Welcome to our tutorial on how to use our 3D printer, the Lulzbot Taz 6. This video assumes you already have the G-code print file ready to print and stored on an SD card. To begin, flip the switch to turn the Taz on. The first step is to prep the printer to accept our plastic filament. To do that, we have to heat the nozzle. Press the button to access the menu. Spin the wheel right to go down to temperature, then select nozzle. Spin the wheel right to heat up the nozzle to around 205 to 215 degrees. Press the button to go back to the main info screen. You will see on the display both the temperature you set the nozzle and its current temperature, which should be rising. While the nozzle is heating, prep the filament by snipping the end to make it easier to insert into the machine. Once the nozzle is ready, insert the filament into the machine. Pull and hold the brace towards you in the direction of the arrow. You will feel two clicks as it goes down. If it's all the way in, you will see filament coming out the bottom of the machine. Push down until you only see the filament of your color come out. To make sure everything is ready, we need to test the extruder. Go down to movement, then move axis, then extruder. You should extrude at least 5 to 10 millimeters of filament to test it. It should flow straight down. With our tests complete, we are ready to print. Scroll down to Print from SD. This menu is very slow, so very carefully scroll down to your print. Wait a few moments to make sure it is the correct print then press the button to start. The machine will first clean the nozzle, probe the corners of the bed, and then start your print. After your print is complete, it's time to prep the machine to turn off. To remove the filament, again heat it to around 205 to 215 degrees. When ready, pull the brace forward, push down to make sure the filament is heated properly, and then pull upwards. To make the next print faster, Clip the end before putting away the filament. Go into the temperature settings and make sure both the bed and the nozzle are set to zero degrees. Once the bed and nozzle are cooled down to about 20 degrees, it is safe to turn off the machine. 